Privacy is essential to who we are as human beings, and we make decisions about it every single day. It gives us space to be ourselves without judgment, allows us to think freely without discrimination, and is an important element of giving us control over who knows what about us. You can find it in the Universal Declaration of Human Rights from 1948, the foundation of our modern understanding of the rights inherent to all human beings. Found in Article 12, the right to privacy protects us against arbitrary and unjustified use of power. It helps us to establish boundaries to limit who has access to our bodies, places and things, as well as our communications and our information. In 1948, the right may have had more relevance for people understanding the right to be left alone and secure in their homes without interference from the state, or to have their letters reach their intended recipient without being opened. But in modern society, it has taken on a much broader significance. With the increasing importance of technology and communications in our lives, it is more important than ever that the governments that are supposed to represent us and the private sector that provide us services that we use do not use our personal data without our consent. Think about it. You're watching this video on a laptop or mobile device. The video is hosted by YouTube, which logs your viewing preference of this video. And even though you're not logged into YouTube, and if you are logged into your YouTube account, Google can build a detailed picture of your viewing habits. Did you use a search engine to find the course? That will log your search term, and also what link you click to visit. Maybe you have a few tabs open in your browser, you're logged into Facebook, chatting to a friend about how awesome this course is. Well, that message is being scanned for keywords to gain a better understanding of you and your friend. Maybe you're doing none of this, and you're just watching this course on your mobile device. Well, in that case, your operating system may be logging your location. All of this is incredibly valuable information to be logged, and never before in our society have we had as much data generated by us and collected by others. And if that data were to be made available to anyone and everyone, we would quickly see our space to learn new things, express new ideas, and engage in debates shrink. This is where the right to privacy makes an important difference. The data that is collected shouldn't just be shared with anyone. These services have a responsibility to protect your data from arbitrary and unlawful use. They also have to have a level of technical security surrounding your data to prevent it from being accessible to anyone who happens to have access to the website. Although increasingly, we've seen a number of services fail to do that. Data protection laws are vitally important to empower the individual user and place obligations on private companies and public bodies to respect your fundamental rights. This will only grow in importance as we continue to find new, innovative, and for some, profitable uses for the data we generate. The impact on human rights of increased communication surveillance practices by intelligence agencies and law enforcement in countries around the world has been a heated debate. The laws that emanate from the right to privacy provide a key safeguard against the use of these powers unless they're used in strictly necessary and proportionate manners for a legitimate aim. Laws Constitutions and human rights conventions play a role here, but most importantly, it is vital that people in civil society organizations across the world understand and continuously raise the necessity of the right to privacy for living freely in a free society and call on governments to protect the rights of all people everywhere. As we continue to be more connected to our cars, our homes and our cities, how each and every one of us have our right to privacy protected, respected and fulfilled will define our lives for decades to come.